when I hear this song, uh, it's like impulsive. I want to start moving around like a mad Egypt. Do you want to have a dance? <laughs> yeah! yeah! What is the story everybody? Kozak here. I'm here with Archie once again uh, for our, what's this called? We still haven't got a name. We're gonna have to decide on a name. We're reviewing uh, music, we're talking about music, we're listening to music and we're driving around. So we're gonna be listening to a couple of tracks from Wob's first album, which is Nostos. Many of your viewers will be very familiar with Wob from the excellent Transmission Festival and many features of his music over to the Mars Live uh, over the last year. So yeah, let's dive into it. We want to listen to this album. It's a cracking album, by the way. It is. It's, uh, it's a great little concept album, which I believe was based on Homer's Odyssey. Yeah, it was. So yeah. from start to finish, this album is going to take you on a journey. And let's just dive into it. Yeah, cool. What's the first song? Um, the first song that I want to listen to is Calypso. Calypso man, uh, what made you choose that one? Because there's so many of them, like what, what kind of draws you It was track? a hard decision to try and limit which ones to talk about. There's not many songs uh, that I'd listen to that give me an urge to want to, you know, groove or dance along to. But when I hear this song, uh, it's like impulsive. I want to start moving around like a mad Egypt. Do you want to have a dance? <laughs> yeah! yeah! Some album release, and it's funny you mentioned Syncopate because uh, Syncopate is one of his tunes as well, and that was not on the album, uh, which is a really cool music video. Single, wasn't it? Really yeah, yeah, yeah. Music video is really cool, actually, as well. Uh, very interesting, um, I have to say. Well, I hope you introduced you introduced me to him last year when I, I think I was doing the review section um, for the start of the Mars Live. Yeah, uh, I think I've done four or five bands and artists, and Wob was one of those artists, and I like my old school trance music, dance music at house, but I wouldn't actively go out and seek um, new variations of that music, but when you sent that to me, I was just hooked. It was one of my most played albums slash artists from Spotify uh, in 2020. Amazing. Yeah. So it came, up, it came up in the top five of my streams. Brilliant. I just kept going back to the album, constantly back, 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 back. That uh, with uh, Calypso and the next song that I chose, which was Run, which uh, I feel uh, Run is a real pop-centric song on the album. For me, it stands out on the album because uh, it's so catchy. Yeah. <laughs> it's oh, just so catchy. Who's, uh, it's with... Um, uh, Owen uh, Martin. Owen it? Martin, yeah. yeah. On vocals. Yeah, yeah. so definitely. Uh, just, a, lot of, a lot of his vibe in there as and well. And the, the breakdown in it as well. When it's, it, it, it just takes a you know, sharp left turn and it comes into this lovely guitar-ridden breakdown. Mm. Oh, it's just perfect. So you've nothing to judge it on. Like even when listening to that album, you, you can't go into it with a pre-meditated, oh this is going to sound like this. Because when you think it's going to sound a certain way, the next song comes on and it's a completely different vibe. Because many 
albums you can listen to and the, the song might not gauge your attention for more than 10 seconds until you find yourself skipping it. Yeah. This album, I found myself going back to the start of the song to catch something. It's like, oh, I like that. I like the way that the swell on the synth went on this one or the way it run, the way they slide on the electric guitar. It just comes down that's nicely delayed and reverb. It was just mixed perfectly as well. That's another good thing uh, with, with great albums is the music and the content can be great. But if it's mixed and edited and produced a certain way, that adds to the album. And this is one of the best produced albums that I've listened to. And thank you for everyone that's ever been watching and checking us out. Hopefully we get another episode of this out. So yeah. if you've got any music, if there's anyone out there and you want us to listen to your music and you want us to talk about your music, send it in to us. Kozak could give you the beats. And don't forget guys to like and share our video as well because of course we want to uh, spread the joys and awesomeness of music. And uh, once again, as Paul mentioned, if you are interested in having your songs listened to on the show, do give us a show. And the we need to name this is, segment. Yeah, we need to name the segment as well. Um, so yeah, do drop us, drop in the comment section your suggestions uh, for this segment. And uh, have a fantastic weekend guys. Take so, it easy. The email. I, oh I yeah, yeah. yeah we're, we're cutting our, we're talking over ourselves here I think Paul's really getting into the presenting thing he won't let me uh, finish my sentences it's he's like me, oh me. yeah oh yeah by the way we love musicians I love musicians and then it's like we should call it the Archie show featuring transmission TV uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna private the video and uh, see how it goes oh, and, like uh, in front of the camera yeah yeah calls, yeah like, hi guys <laughs> it's me me, 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 and this fella here. Uh, what's his name again? David? Oh, it's Kozak. Yeah, I forgot. This cunt likes to call himself something different. <laughs>